tree that memorializes my mother, who was a survivor of racism and torture and oppression. And it's from her that I get my ethics and that I get my confidence that what I'm doing is absolutely right. They could not, the Labour Party, have chosen a better place for what is happening now. And I want to tell you how it was upstairs. I was facing a panel of some six, seven people, must have been, I don't know, three or four lawyers, the serried ranks of the booted and suited of the Labour Party. It was a, initially described as an informal process. Can I just say now, as you know, that I went in with the gravest concerns, not just about the fairness that there has been in the last few weeks, with members of the PLP demanding my expulsion, with newspapers publishing stories full of lies and smears, but actually what's happened to me in the last two, three years. I want to say that I insist on my rights and my entitlement to be judged with justice. Yeah. 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 I insist that the Labour Party sticks to its claim to be a party that is for all, for the many and not the few who are either in Parliament or in other positions of power. I insist that the Labour Party adheres to due process, to natural justice, and the application of justice for all equally. And in that spirit, I made a request to address the panel in this informal process. Now the panel adjourned to give it what they said was their careful consideration. And after consulting the Labour Party lawyers, they have yet again refused my voice to be heard in my defence. So not, so not only do they ban my voice as a film, as a documentary film, made, sponsored, by Jewish Voice for Labour, made by an independent filmmaker with mostly Jewish people. Not only do they ban me in terms of the, the lynching, but they actually ban to hear my voice in what would have been the most brief of statements. Now, as far as I'm concerned, this only confirms my worst fears about the process and the fairness and the justice which the Labour Party offers people who support Corbyn. That the fairness and justice that the Labour Party offers Jews who support Jeremy Corbyn. The fairness and justice that the Labour Party offers people of colour who support Jeremy Corbyn. I want you I want you to ask yourselves, I want you to ask the NEC, ask the NCC, ask your MPs, ask each other, what is so dangerous about the voice of Jackie Walker? Because if you answer that question, you will understand what is happening here. Now, obviously, 
what has just occurred is absolutely shocking. Though in a way not surprising, unfortunately. I mean, I stand at this point, I have to tell you, deeply ashamed of the structures of the Labour Party that I am a member of. What I've decided is that I'm going to take stock of this statement and actually re re release my response later today to actually have time to consider what I'm going to say about what's happened to me in the last few years as well as today. And really, to finish this awful and long process with just the only thing that we have to battle against those with power. And that's our solidarity. So solidarity, comrades. Everybody, stand up. Don't give up the fight.